welcome to our lovely day of photographing another chateau. So here we are in my favorite room in this castle. Um, we're at the place with the marble stairs. Uh, it's absolutely a gorgeous room. So in order for us to light and create a dramatic mood for this specific area, I have used uh, quite a few touch of lights for this setup. So here, we have all the paint. We've got a few different like, uh, Godox units here. We have the Godox 8400 running through with the CTO gel. Uh, it's boomed just to get us all out of the way of the model. Uh, we have another light hanging hang from the side uh, here through a Snoot 8200 uh, with another CTO gel to make sure that we are rimmed appropriately for lighting. Uh, and we have a constant light LED on the side over here um, to add a little bit of ambiance uh, for the natural, uh, natural fill here. So make sure that the background itself is not too cross-colored when we are uh, doing our photos. So, come down, there's one last, uh, a couple more accent lights that we have in this setup. Um, there's another LED panel set to run towards the actual wall area here. Um, when it's on, you'll see what it can do. And inside this room, we have another accent light. We have an 8600 BM, which is battery powered, very easy to move around, and we have it double CTO to add additional warmth into the actual scene itself. Um, so yeah, let's take a look at some of the photos and see what comes out. And now we have our first scene set up and finished with the blue uh, intentional background area using Tungsten white balance. And so now we're about to switch over to show you what the difference is without the color gels and just make sure that everything's just a daylight balance for the interiors, exteriors, and all the lights. So we're gonna change that quick and we'll show you what happens there. Okay, thank you. 